Welcome to the PNSO Dinosaur Museum. Season 4, The Large Herbivorous Dinosaurs. Arma the Mamunchosaurus. Its neck was the same length as the rest of its body. Scientific name, Mamunchosaurus. Period, Late Jurassic. Fossils found in China, Asia. Description. Mamunchosaurus was a gigantic sauropod. Its body was slightly narrower than its peers, and its slender neck and tail account for most of the length of the body. All sauropod dinosaurs had a long neck. Mamunchosaurus took it to an extreme. Mamunchosaurus's very eye-catching neck was the same length as the rest of its body. This ratio is unique among all dinosaurs. Unlike a human neck, the neck of Mamunchosaurus did not have a uniform thickness. The part of the neck close to the head was relatively thin, and the part close to the body was thicker and stronger. Although this dinosaur could not elevate its neck completely like a giraffe, the neck was not parallel to the ground. It formed an angle with the ground and lifted the head somewhat up. What is the use of this long neck? Let's see what it could do for Arma, the Mamunchosaurus in front of us. The long neck helped it to reach food far away. The 22-meter-long Arma was a large dinosaur, and it naturally had some difficulty moving around, especially in the forest. With its long neck, it could stand stationary in one place and eat a lot of food by moving its neck in an arc. Compared to the huge body, Arma's mouth was pitifully small, and hence it ate slowly. In order to meet its metabolic needs, Apart from sleeping, it spent almost all its time eating. Its teeth were only good enough to cut food like scissors or rake leaves off the branches. The teeth didn't allow for chewing or grinding. Its favorite food was the leaves of conifers. Arma needed to use its teeth constantly, and the teeth wore out quickly. Arma's solution was that new teeth would grow in quickly to replace the worn ones. Arma's small head looked narrow and tall. Its nostrils were at the front part of the head, near the top of the skull, and the eyes were behind the nostrils. Its small brain meant that it was not particularly smart, but thanks to its good eyesight, it could detect danger early and from a long way away. In addition to its long neck, Arma the Mamunchosaurus also had a long tail that deserves mentioning, because it did more than balancing the body. At the tip of the tail there was a tail club, a weapon to defend itself against predators. If a predator wanted to get close, it could swing the tail and threaten the predator. Because most of Arma's body was its slender neck and tail, it was lightweight relative to its length. Its limbs were nevertheless strong with well-developed muscles and could support its body. Arma the Mamunchosaurus lived in the late Jurassic period, near present-day Chongqing, China. In the place where it lived, there were many ferocious predators, such as Yangtranosaurus and Sichuanosaurus. Fortunately, because of its huge body, few of those picked it as an easy target. Welcome to the PNSO Dinosaur Museum. Join our writer, Miss Yang Yang, and artist, Mr. Zhao Chuang, and start this fantastic journey. <laughs>